everybody. On this episode of Van of My Dreams, we take you along for the ride with us as we head to Sandy Beach Campground in Rio Vista, California for the Super Chili Bowl. The beef was browned and the peppers were chopped. We made our chili ahead of time before hitting the road for Rio Vista, California. Pizza. 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 Why is it so good? And we made it to the campground by about noon, and we're delighted to see a bunch of other vans and buses hanging out already set up as we set up our camps with our friends Jeff and Lisa. People were already getting ready for the Super Chili Bowl with their competition and their entries for the fierce, fierce, fierce battle. And there were more than 15 entries in the chili competition. Some people made vegetarian, some people made meat. There was even a snow goose chili. And we all gathered and shared van and bus stories around the tent of doom set up by this man, John. Here you can see, getting number seven, the one of the best chilies in the competition. On the left, you can see pot number six empty, who would later become the winner of this great battle. And after having Ken's carry me back to the van for being way too full off of chili, it was time to go to bed and wake up in the morning to make new friends. <laughs> Good morning. Hi. Sunday morning at like 7 30. Oh, sleepy. And everything is fogged up. <laughs> Fog City. So I ate way more chili than a human should ever eat, and I was really uncomfortable all night. We won honorable mention. We won fifth place. <laughs> it was awesome. We won a bag of beef jerky, so I found my people. Um, really. out of how many chilies were there? Oh, there was like 20 chilies. Yeah, so we did pretty good for the that first cool. year. You're excited. Oh god, I ate way too much number five and number six chili though. <laughs> they were too good. Oh. Wow. Love you. Love you. Two. Bye. What's your name? Uh, my name's Alex. What's your van's name? Blue Dream. Oh, that's so rad. Do you know yeah, the reference to Blue Dream? I sure do. <laughs> <laughs> that's so great. How long have you had your van? Uh, about two years. It's beautiful. It's a 1990 Synchro SD. I've done a lot to it with my dad's help. That's my dad, Bill, and he's had it at 84. Hi, Bill. Hi. What's your van's name? Old Paint. Old Paint, that's yeah. right. Original, right? Yeah, it's original paint. Yeah, it hasn't been painted yet. Beautiful. Yeah. I love We've had it. it for 31 years. We bought it off a lot. Oh, wow. That's so cool. Yeah. What's your name? Philip. What's your van's name? Heart of Gold. And what year is it? 86. What's your favorite part about van life? This? Right here. This, right here. I couldn't Camping. agree more. Uh huh. There's a really good group. We fell into it and have enjoyed every moment ever since. There's never been a bad feeling with these guys. I am Joe. And what's your bus's name? Oh, I don't name my buses. Okay. It says Epicenter on the license plate. I like that. I was referring to it as the Epicenter. Yeah, it's always been known as the Epicenter bus. What's your favorite part about van life? Tow trucks? Uh, no, I don't know. Um, I've had buses for 40 years, so I don't know. Everything. Everything. I love it. Hello. Hey. What's your name? Uh, Jeff. <laughs> and what's your name? Lisa. Hi, Jeff and Lisa. What's your van's name? This is Blondie. And she's a? 84 Westie. Nice. Can't be appropriate. Yay. Yay. Thank you so much for inviting us. This has been the best weekend ever. I agree. My hippie love, my hippie love. She makes skirts out of shirts. My hippie love. Give her trees, give her herbs. Let her walk barefoot in the dirt. She's my love. Smile.
face of that girl. It's, it's the smile that I chase around the world. She laying on my chest. Yeah, that's when I'm at my best. Best in the world. I be love. And I can't explain your scent to my nose. There's some kind of crazy pheromone. My brain now you're driving me insane, insane in love, in love. Now she's tied up everything we own and gathered all the belongings for the road. Moved out of that tent, bought a van and sold our shit, kept our love. told us that we had to go to this bar called Foster's that was in town. Foster's in Bighorn. Foster's Bighorn. They had like 250 animal heads that were taxidermy. It was crazy. There were rhinos and buffalo and elephants and giraffes and all sorts of crazy stuff. Yeah. Squirrels, badgers. It was interesting. Wolves. Wolves. Pretty much name any animal. Here we go. We're going over the bridge again. Here we go. And I didn't look at the... Well, we'll see you Hi, Willow. Hi, Willow. Oh, she's all okay. Photo op. Photo op. Yeah, she's like, what, you're crazy? I'm like... And just like that, all the chili pots cleaned up, camps packed up, and Westy Tops put back down. Everybody said goodbye. They're gone. We miss you, Jeff and Lisa. <laughs> oh my God. We miss you. I got a fart. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can catch our next episode. Peace and love, friends! Hello! Here, you hold it. I'm driving. Yeah. First Vanagon trip in the bag. It was awesome. Nice to us together. I don't know. You're silly. That was sweet. That was fun. <laughs> High five. <laughs>